Hey everybody, Patrick here from One Shot Kill It Media. Today we're going to be doing a quick range review of the Arms Corps Rock Island Armory M1911A1 FS TAC Ultra. So let's go ahead and get started. I bet it's going to be pretty effing awesome. Let's go. Alright guys, so what we're going to do here next is just test out uh, quick target acquisition and follow up shots just to see how it goes. Alright, let's get started. All right, so on the larger targets I was doing okay, having a little bit of trouble dialing in the smaller targets, so I'm gonna go ahead and give those a try next. There we go. So I just had to get it tuned in a little bit here just to get used to that smaller target. Uh, but as you can see, it was hitting pretty consistently with that. So let's go ahead. We'll just try a couple other uh, just exercises here and a couple different shooting styles just to see what happens. All right, so we're going to try just a quick reload here next just to see how fast we can reload and then get back on target. So let's go ahead and uh, just give it a shot. guys here we go just a little bit more of the uh, attack ultra action here so let's go ahead we're about 10 yards out too just to give you an idea of distance Alright folks, next we're going to try just a couple one-handed shots just to see how controllable the gun is when you're not in an ideal situation or when your other hand is not able to be used. Here we go. Alright, so easy to control even with one hand. And I don't know if you guys have ever realized this or not, but my... Uh, my right pinky here does not work. It's stuck like this, it's a hook. Um, so sometimes that does make, you know, grips a little difficult depending on the type of weapon. Uh, but this 1911 with the grips, the way that they're patterned and everything, uh, the design, everything, it just, it works together to make a gun that is uh, very usable and controllable, which I really like. So let's go ahead and keep moving. All right, so next we're gonna do the same thing, only we're gonna use our weak side, which is my left side. So let's go ahead and give that a try. So three out of four with my weak side. I'm pretty satisfied with that. I mean, that's the first time I tried shoot with my weak hand all day. So overall, just gotta say I'm impressed with it. It's a great pistol so far. The M1911A1 TAC Ultra, FS TAC Ultra. Single stack 45 by Rock Island Armory Arms Corps. Uh, so again, kick ass gun. Let's keep moving forward. Hey guys, I just wanna give you a quick close up of this trigger in action. I'm really digging it so far. You just watch and be the judge. Let me know what you think. Hey guys, just another angle here shooting with the Rock Island. I uh, just wanted to show you, I mean, this gun just points naturally very well. Uh, easy to just push out and get on target. 
and I think overall one of the nice things about it that I like is that it's it's not too heavy and it's not too light this little bit of an extra rail that's built in up front definitely adds a little bit of weight to it but it's nice it actually helps even you out in terms of recoil it feels like so let's go ahead and shoot again here quick for you all right so we're just gonna quick point out all right comfortable pistol i really like it all right guys so last little bit of wrap up here again during all this testing i was using arms core usa 45 acp ammunition this stuff ran great uh, overall, no complaints. I really like it. Um, it's 45 ACP. What is there to complain about? It's great. <laughs> so we've got that. Now, let's get to the actual pistol again here just for a breakdown. Um, this is the Rock Island Armory Arms Corps M1911A1 FS Tactical Ultra. Now this is a single stack, 45 ACP. And let's just get a little light on it so you can see all the little features here. The rail, the trigger, red front sight, white back sights, very nice grips, very aggressive, nice checkering on the mag release and on the slide release, and the magwell extension, very nice feature. I was very impressed with this gun all the way around. Um, weight wise it's perfect, you know it's not too heavy, not too light. This, uh, the built in rail up front that I really enjoy. Um, that adds a little bit of weight to it, but that weight isn't detrimental by any means. It actually helps uh, control some of your recoil. So I really liked that, and it, you know the build-in of it, it just looks really nice, so I was digging that. Um, again, the sights were great. Once I got used to them, I was you know having an easy time getting on target. Very tight group. Uh, was able to shoot that earlier, and that was nice. Um, as you can see, I was just putting you know shots right on top of each other after I got dialed in. Um, overall, you know, again, the checkering on the slide release here in the mag release was very nice, uh, made it easy to operate, easy to find it. And then also, um, the magwell extension, I really enjoyed that, it was easy to funnel those mags in, um, as opposed to trying to get just into that little slot when you're kind of trying to run yourself on time. So very, very cool. I really like that feature, the little extension. I think that's nice. Uh, the aggressive grip style was very, very nice as well. I thoroughly enjoyed that. Um, you know, it's it's not to the point where it was tearing my hand up or anything like that, but it made it easy to grip and control the weapon the whole time. Uh, so that that was nice. And then that actually came in handy uh, quite a bit when I was using, you know, um, a single hand to shoot and my weak hand to shoot. Uh, so having that extra bit of grip there, um, I shouldn't say extra grip, but aggressive grip was very handy. Um, made it easy to control the pistol. So overall, again, this is the Rock Island Armory M1911A1 FS Tactical Ultra. Uh, this is a single stack 45 ACP, and I just think it is a fantastic buy. Uh, a pistol like this, under $1,000, you just really can't go wrong. Um, it's got all the features of other, you know, $1,000 plus 1911s put into a package for, I think, just under 800 and it's impressive it's accurate it shoots well um, it shoots as accurate as you can shoot obviously <laughs> a lot of that comes down to the person who's behind the gun um, but yeah overall just very very impressed I'm very happy I was able to get my hands on this pistol um, and again I just I have to say I'm giving it high marks overall across the board um, aesthetically functionally you know everything about this pistol was good if not great. Um, so again, very impressed overall. I think Rock Island Armory Arms Corps did a great job. They knocked this one out of the park. And if you're interested in a full-size 1911, uh, this is definitely the route you'd want to take, especially if you're on a budget. It doesn't get much better than this. So thanks again for tuning in, everybody. Uh, like always, you know, if you could please hit that subscribe button. Um, that's the way that I'm able to build relationships with companies like Arms Corps, Rock Island Armory. Um, and every other manufacturer that's out there. The more subscribers I have and the more people tuning in to see if it's a, if it's a good buy or to learn about the uh, pistol they already have or rifle or products or gear or whatever it may be that we review. Um, again, it just comes down to subscribers and allowing me to, to continue to expand my reach 
and uh, review these different products that you have an interest in and that you spend your hard-earned dollars on. So please go ahead and hit that uh, subscribe button for me. I'd really appreciate it. And then, uh, as always, you know, like on Facebook, follow on Instagram. We'll have plenty more information and, uh, and features coming out with this pistol. I'm going to get it in the hands of some other folks that have probably shot a lot of 1911s, get it in the hands of folks that have never touched a 1911, and just get a little bit of feedback overall um, with this pistol as to, as to what folks like, regardless of their experience level with the platform. So I'm looking forward to it. Again, what a fantastic gun. Uh, Rock Island Armory Arms Corps, great job. Uh, this is what a 1911 is supposed to be, and you guys did it for a price that's affordable for most people. Uh, so, again, great work. I think it's awesome. This is One Shot Kill at Media. Please subscribe, and thanks again for watching, everybody. Have a great day. We'll see you soon.